rage Never can step in the head and level above his place Reaping the benefits out of less who had the face Pulling a level, we leave a message, not a trace Pushing a button, we guarantee Good morning guys, how's it going? It is Wednesday today, so two days before we leave I have a very big meeting with one of my biggest clients today hopefully everything goes well so i'm headed over to that right now um it's like 10 30 ish right now um in the morning and i was actually supposed to go to the gym in the morning today and i was going to take the night off but me being the genius i am i only set one alarm and i hit i, I thought i hit snooze but i i guess i closed it out and I ended up waking up on my second alarm, which was to remind me to leave the gym and get home and get ready for the meeting. So, I mean, it's not a big deal because I'm still gonna go. I, I could just go at night now because I got extra sleep during the day. Um, so that's probably what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try and do chest and back today, but usually that takes a lot longer because I like to really focus on, you know, focus on those muscles and make sure I do enough movements to actually see potential for the next week or at least be sore enough to you know justify that I had a really good workout um but you know no big deal you just gotta rearrange the schedule a little bit um I'm gonna do this meeting and then I actually have to head all the way back to uh Manhattan which kind of sucks because right now I'm, I'm on my way to Long Island I live in Long Island so I'm going like a little bit deeper into Long Island then I have to head back to Manhattan um until like five or six which you know whatever um well that's that's about it guys that's the the update for the morning and then i'll catch you guys hopefully when the meeting's over all right guys so the meeting went pretty well um we got a decent amount but it's not the amount that i wanted originally but it's fine not a big deal these are the type of things that you kind of got to just roll with um but I'm just happy that something closed and uh, we're gonna move forward from here. We're gonna have another meeting with the same client in about three months and then we're gonna see if we can bring some more. Other than that, work aside, um, I have to go back to Manhattan now, I'm still in Long Island, so I'm just gonna grab lunch very quickly. Um, and then I gotta head back before um, the day's over that I gotta come back all the way out here. So, pretty tough day, but still, I'm definitely gonna hit the jump tonight. Like I said, I couldn't hit it in the morning. So we should be good on that part. I'm gonna try and do chest and back today. Or I can do chest and triceps and back and biceps. Uh, I can do chest and triceps today and then back and biceps. So, I'm sorry, I wanted to do it the other way around, but whatever. Um, we'll see, because right now the, the main concern is just uh, timing, because tomorrow's my last day, my last full day in the US. Friday we leave, but I work in the morning, so as soon as I get out of work, I gotta rush back to Long Island and just try and get to my flight on time, hopefully. And then we'll continue a travel vlog from, from that point forward. Um, and also, there are two things that I'm really trying to set up in, in Bangladesh right now, is the gym. I gotta make sure that there's a gym there because uh, I wanna at least go for an hour and a half every day. And uh, what else? And Wi-Fi. I need Wi-Fi to edit and then upload. I'm gonna try and get the vlogs up while I'm there. That's the main issue I had with the um, with the Dubai vlogs was that hey, the UAE vlogs basically I didn't have the um, I didn't have the time to actually upload it or like even edit it in in the UAE. And by the time I got here, I started putting it up, but it came out very late. If you see the the timing between all of the videos. Um, I'm gonna try and basically, you know, do everything there and then get them uploaded in due time and then hopefully I can catch up to where I am currently because I think every vlog you guys are watching is about a week after it happens. But uh, hopefully that works out. I'm just gonna head home and grab some lunch. Um, I just got a small iced coffee from Duncan. Um, it was like Splenda almond milk and uh, French vanilla swirl, I think. Really like just one squirt. And uh, that's it so far. I'll probably have lunch, grab another coffee on the way back to work, and then probably just head to the gym after. So I'll catch you guys in a little bit. So I'm headed back to work now. Um, so usually what I do is I park in Queens, and I take the F train all the way to Manhattan, because it draws me like, uh, like a block or two away from my office. So a pretty good meeting in the morning, like I told you guys already. Uh, it's always a pain 
find parking in Queens, but luckily I found something. So I'm just going to, uh, I had like a slice of pizza for lunch too. So I'm just gonna head to work and then we'll see how it goes from there. So just got home from work. There's a flash flood warning going on right now. And then I just saw a bunch of cops going like the opposite direction, like 10 cops and then like a bunch of undercover cops. I don't know what's going on, um, but it looked like they were going to Queens. So hopefully nothing insane. Um, there's a flash flood warning going on. I'm probably still gonna go to the gym. That's probably not gonna stop me, but I did get a Nintendo Switch for the flight because I might be bored out of my mind. I'm gonna do a quick unboxing of that. So let's get to that. Yeah, so I got the uh, the gray one, the Nintendo Switch. Then I got Skyrim and Dragon Ball Z. Skyrim was still $60, which is ridiculous, but I guess you get all the DLC with it, so it kind of makes sense. But um, Dragon Ball Z was like 30 bucks, which probably means it sucks. But regardless, what can we do now, right? Nintendo Switch. And I, you know, I had a Nintendo 64, but I never had the Wii. So I guess this is one side. That's the other side. And it's like the skin or something. It's like the main piece. Yep. That's it. Like a stand on it. I wonder if you could go on the internet with this. If I could watch like shows on it, that'd be pretty dope. If I just click it on it. How does this work? Do I have to slide it? Oh, so you just slide it on. Yeah, I probably I used like a Nintendo Switch once, and I just used the joysticks at like my friend's house. Um, that's it. I just got the gray one. I wasn't a big fan of the the red and blue one. Let's see what else in here. They give you the HDMI. That's nice. Plug it into the TV. I guess this is the charger, which is a USB-C. Awesome. So I incorporated that. And then what is this for? Oh, so you can use it kind of like a controller. That's pretty cool too. Okay. I guess it's like a holder. If you want to like clip it onto the side and just have it on the go. And I just let it out. And then, what do we have here? This is the, the rest of the stand, I guess, because I'm plugging into the TV. It's pretty cool, I guess. I heard the battery life on this thing sucks though. So I'm gonna have to bring the charger with me on the plane. Hopefully they have something to uh, plug it into. And that's it, I guess. Um, I'm gonna set it up, show you guys once again. I just got the gray one. Um, so this is, I just got it for the flight. Let's see, hopefully I like it. Um, Skyrim I played a bunch of times before. I'm not really into RPG games, but this game I liked a lot, and then I'm a big Dragon Ball Z fan since I was a kid. I wonder if they have an Naruto game, maybe I'll pick that up as well. But that's it guys, I'll let you know how I feel about it. And then I'm actually gonna grab some to eat and then head to the gym, so I'll let you guys know tomorrow how I like it. There you go, closer look. So my Amazon Prime shopping is done. I got this huge Himalayan salt lamp thing because I wanted one. It's like 10 bucks or like 12 bucks or something and it's super heavy. Um, I got some coffee for work and I got a port portable charger to take with me while I travel. I think altogether it was like 40 bucks for everything. And that's about it. And I bought some a screen protector in a case for the for the switch that's hopefully gonna be here tomorrow before we leave. But that's it for now, guys. Yeah. So we we picked this up from um from Rite Aid. What is it? Jalapeno Mexican pe Mexican <laughs> jalapeno peanut M&M. Did you say jalapeno? Yeah. Record me eating it. Let's see. Yeah, just cover it. Cover the camera with your uh, with your hand. It like creeps up on you. It's so strange. Yeah, it's gross. It's so weird though. You make him uncle try it and dad.
disgusting. I'm gonna take that to work and like prank people. <laughs> Wait, that's not one anymore. It's so interesting. I will not. I will not recommend that to anybody. But like, who even thought this was a good idea? Probably you. All right, guys. So that's it. Um, today is the day we leave. I just have to get to work. Again, it's an early day today. It's six twenty-six, and uh, <clears throat> well, I'm like right by the train, so I gotta hop on the train and then go to work for the day. Get it around three-ish. Gotta head back home. Just finish up a couple of things and then head to the airport. Um, so I'm gonna end the vlog here, actually. And then the next couple of vlogs, probably two or three, are going to be um, the travel vlogs. And I uh, hope you guys are looking forward to that. I hope you guys do watch those. Make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe on this vlog. <clears throat> and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Take it, take it easy, guys. Never could step in ahead of level above his pace Reaping the benefits, adolescent who had the face Pulling a lever, we'll leave a message, not a trace